women you're about to meet are proof that if you dream big and live fearlessly, the sky's the limit for whatever you really want to do, literally. I got the honor to fly with an all-female crew with the United States Air Force at Joint Base mcguire dix Lakehurst on a refueling mission over 30,000 feet in the air. I know. Talk about girl power. Check this out. Hi, I'm Drew. I'm Colonel Michelle Obianco. I'm the 305th Operations Group Commander. It's so nice to meet you. Hi, Drew. I'm Colonel Mary Teeter, and I'm the 305th Maintenance Group Commander. We have a great team. It's very rare that you see two female O6s. But, uh, any girl that's out there that'll watch her segment, they can see it, they can dream it, and they know that they can do it. I'm yeah. really, really excited. You said you are a thrill seeker, so how do you that feel? I am, yes. How do you feel about being about 12 feet behind another aircraft at a couple hundred knots? Yeah, of course. Of course, it's big. I'm like Charlie's Angels. We like yes. to get on the wings of the flying plane and jump out with the mask and the parachute. Thank so if you're ladies. ready, let's go. Yes, thank you. Hi guys. Happy to see you. So these are all of our aerial port airmen and they're responsible for passenger and cargo movement. They lined up to see you come in and give you a wave. So and formal and fancy. I'm so like groovy and casual. <laughs> but tell me one detail about yourself. Moved here two years ago, like snowboarding. I like to cook. I like to collect cookbooks. Me and the wife have a kid about every 10 years, so that's our superpower. So. <laughs> So here. nice to meet you, yeah. too. Let's get you briefed up. Let's get you ready to fly. Ma'am, I'm Captain Nicole McCarthy. I'll be your KC-10 instructor pilot for today. And that's the air refueling aircraft. So we actually give off the gas to the C-17. And I'm Captain Caitlin Stark Axiola, and I'll be the C-17 aircraft commander. So I'll be the jet that's receiving the fuel today. I am your weather forecaster for the flight today. Mm -hmm. Current conditions are quite cloudy, with more clouds coming in just a little bit around uh, landing time. Are we going to have turbulence? Are we going to get some stomach jumps, butterflies? No, no, ma'am. Uh, little to no turbulence expected. But I'm so excited for this flight mission. Ma'am, one last thing before you go. To make your flight suit more official so you're not going out completely nameless, we have some patches for you. <gasps> this is so cool. This is so me. Yeah. Perfect. Uh... Ma'am, you're ready to fly. Let's step out and get going. All right, ma'am. fly in these planes? Getting to travel and getting to participate in a lot of different missions. Yeah. So I've gotten to go to about 40 different countries in oh this plane. God. What are we going to be doing in here today? So we're going to get fuel from the other plane. OK, great. Uh, so we'll, we'll fly gonna... up right behind them and connect. That's so rad. I can't wait. OK, mm -hmm. well, then I guess I'll see you across the way, neighbor. Yes. We need to make sure that everything is put on safely and restrained. Well, yeah, safely. you don't want this thing flying around. Exactly. So we use these big chains and devices. Do you actually want to take a go at it? Sure. Yeah? Hold do on. I need gloves. You do. You do. Here we so go. there are your gloves. And we have a belt for you. So push down on this lever back here in the back. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Perfect. And then twist it towards you. There we go. And then so that's locking it into place.
thank you to the members of the 305th Air Mobility Wing. And some of them are here now. Hello! I just want to say I had the greatest day with you. Thank you so much uh, for allowing not just myself, but this whole show into your world. I have the patches out of myself, Olive and Frankie. I also have my special other wings and I just have them all over our apartment. And so I've been thinking about you guys every single day since that mission and you are just forever in my heart and mind. And I wanna really, really, really tell you what a special experience that was. Thank you for allowing me to do that. <laughs> Maybe I'll uh, catch you on another flight someday. Thank you so much for your service. And please thank all the other members who aren't here today that I had such a, pleasure speaking with. Not only did I love the flight so much, but hearing everybody's story and a detail about their lives was such a highlight for me. So thank you. Thank you so much again.